so good morning good afternoon good evening friends today we are going to discuss on mis executive interview questions and answers so these are most most asked 100% asked interview questions and answers for mis interview if you want to become the mis executive from support work or any other work there are a lot of government opportunities as well where mis executive is much more required so you can refer this video and it will i will guarantee you if you can see this video till end you will crack your mis interview for sure so let's get started so i'm closing my video and we'll start with uh, the questions discussion if you want these mis interview questions free of cost in pdf format the need is to subscribe the channel click on bell icon and share me the mail on complex sql at gmail.com which you can see it on the screen okay so if you want all the questions in pdf format free of cost please mail me i will give it to you for sure so let's get started can you explain uh, the first question uh, we will start with first question can you explain your experience with managing and analyzing data for decision making purpose answer is in my previous role i was responsible for collecting and analyzing data from various sources such as sales report customer feedback report i used tools like excel and sql to create the reports dashboards that provided insights for strategic decision making so if you want to become the mis executive you should know the sql you should know the excel very well uh, to take the strategic level decisions how do you ensure the data accuracy and integrity in your work so this is also important data accuracy is important i pay close attention to details when collecting and entering the data double checking for any errors or inconsistencies additionally i regularly validate the data against source documents and conduct audits to identify and correct the discrepancies so if data is there wrong data is also there so you require to identify the discrepancy in the data as a mis executive so how you can do that you require to do regular audits of the data okay third interview question is can you give the example of complex data analysis project you have completed so this is also important uh, question i led a project to analyze customers purchasing pattern using a combination of transactional data and demographic information by applying advanced statistical techniques i identify the key trends and segments that inform the targeted marketing strategies resulting in significant increase in the sales so you can share any example whatever you have completed in your day to day experience just like uh, if you can ask me i i will tell just like that so i was working as a ms executive in for amazon services so for amazon services i have checked the gathered the data for tvs uh, which have uh, which are very demanding and which we require to increase the significant sale so with that data i have provided my insights that these kind of tv like samsung tvs are right now best selling options for the amazon so that they will increase their flow just like that you can tell any any of the example next is how do you handle the tight deadlines while working on the multiple projects simultaneously so as a mis executive you require to work on multiple simultaneous projects so how to deal with that situation i prioritize the task based on their importance and deadline breaking down larger projects into manageable steps i also communicate proactively with the stakeholders to manage the expectation and negotiate the realistic timelines whenever necessary so you can directly answer this okay next question describe your experience with the database management system and data visualization tools so you should know the data visualization tools and dbms as a ms executive so you can tell that names i am proficient working with dbms such as mysql oracle postgresql where i have created the created and maintained the databases to store and retrieve the information effectively 
I have also used the tools like Tableau, Power BI to visualize the data and create interactive dashboards for the stakeholders. How do you ensure that your reports and analysis analysis are easy understandable for non-technical stakeholders as uh, you know that uh, you are having non-technical stakeholders in the group right so it's your responsibility it's your job to give them the proper insight about what is going on in the data front right so i have created my sample answer I use clear and concise language in my reports, avoiding technical jargon language wherever possible. You don't require to use the technical language as there are multiple stakeholders who don't know technicalities of it. I also incorporate visualizations like charts, graphs to present the complex information. Like I have used pie chart, I have used bar charts to show the multiple information uh, in more digestible format to the non-technical users. Next question, how do you stay updated with the latest trends and advancements, advancements in MIS and data analytics? Answer for the same is, I actively participate in professional development opportunities such as workshops, webinars and online courses to stay informed about emerging technologies and best practices in MIS and data analytics. Additionally, I enjoy networking with industry peers to exchange insights and learn from their experiences next question describe your experience with process improvement initiatives related to data management and analysis so i have involved in process improvements project where i have streamlined data collection procedures implemented automation tools and optimized database structures to enhance the efficiency and accuracy so you can remember three things process improvement if process improvement comes into the picture you require to tell the data collection activities procedures then automation tool use and third is optimization of the database you will require to talk about that these initiatives resulted in time saving and improved data quality next question how do you handle confidential and or sensitive information in your role I strictly adhere the data security protocols. You might know the, about the HIPAA policies. You might know about the GDPR policy for European Union. If you are working on European Union data or if you are working on healthcare data, HIPAA policy is important. So just like that, you have to have understanding about the security protocols while handling the data. And you have to adhere to data security property and access controls to ensure that confidential information is only accessed by authorized personal personal i also encrypt the sensitive data encryption is more more important in your role when transmitting and storing it and regularly review and update security measures to mitigate potential risks next question can you provide the example of a time when you identified data quality issue and implemented solution to address it so this is also important question for mis executives so uh, the answer for the same is i notified or noticed the discrepancies in sales data between different reporting systems which were causing the confusion amongst the stakeholders after investigating i discovered that the issue stemmed from inconsistent data entry practices i implemented standardized procedures provided training to ensure consistent data capture resolving the issue and improving the data accuracy so you can give any example next question how do you collaborate with other departments or teams to gather the data and fulfill the reporting requirements coordination is very very important okay i establish strong relationship between the key stakeholders across the departments to understand their data needs and requirements i work closely with them to define data collection methods ensure data consistency and deliver reports that meet their specific needs and deadlines. Describe your experience with data governance and com compliance regulations. So I have solid understanding of data governance principles and compliance regulations such as GDPR and HIPAA. I ensure that data handling practices align with these regulations by implementing appropriate controls, conducting regular audits and providing training, training to the staff members. So 
sometimes you require to provide the training to the staff members as well next question how do you handle unexpected changes or challenges in your projects this is also important i approach unexpected changes or challenges with adaptability or problem solving skills i assess the situation identify alternative solutions and communicate effectively with the stakeholders to adjust timeline or resources as needed to overcome the challenge and keep project on track next question can you give example of successful data driven decision that you facilitated lot of times you required to do that i recommended a change in pricing strategy based on analysis of the customer purchase behavior and market trends by implementing new pricing model we were able to increase the revenue and market share while maintaining the customer satisfaction levels high that discussion i was uh, the key person who facilitated what motivates you to work and as an mis coordinator this is simple and important question has been asked in every mis coordinator interview questions i am passionate about leveraging the data to drive informational de informed decision making and improve the business outcomes the opportunity to contribute to strategic initiatives and make meaningful impact through data analysis and interpretation is what motivates me in this role so these 15 mis executive interview questions are most most important interview questions so please please uh please uh subscribe my channel if you want these interview questions at free of cost click on bell icon it will really help me uh, to grow my channel because i am doing lot of hard work i am just checking with multiple developers and coming up with multiple interview questions just for you guys so please subscribe the channel support me click on bell icon and thanks for watching this video till end cheers